It's really hot today in the Abkhazian capital, Sohome. It's about 35 degrees Celsius, and it's also hot on the streets where people are discussing the recent developments which, t which took place in Moscow, the sessions of the Federation Council and the State Duma, and all the people here in Abkhazia are excited with the, um, you know, with the decision to, uh, to recognize Abkhazia and South Ossetia as independence by the two chambers of Russian parliament. And now I'm joined here uh, by Irina Tsuzhba, who is a student in Abkhazia, uh, a representative of the Abkhazian people. So, Irina, uh, what's the attitude of the Abkhazian people towards today's developments? What's your reaction? So, as you all know, today is a great day for our nation. Throughout our history, a small Abkhaz nation had to struggle a lot and to, had to face a lot of challenges in order to have this day to come true. And we faced uh, the disasters of wars, the sweetness of victory, and the bitterness of, of the injustice. But uh, with the help of our brothers, with every single nation, every single person who understands that each nation, no matter how small or big it is, has a right to be recognized and has a right to live. And so today we are so close to our independence, and it's just so difficult to talk about it. So I'm just so full of emotions. and. I want to say a big thank you for for everybody who helped us. So, Irina, and what do you expect uh, in the nearest future if uh, the independence of Abkhazia is recognized? Uh, what will it bring to this republic? So, um, today we're at the point when we're so close to our very same desire. And um, I think that recognition will bring a lot. First, is, it was this, uh, a desire of every single citizen of our country, from very young people, from children to the adults. And uh, I think that it will bring a lot, a lot of challenges. Uh, hopefully, we'll um, rehabilitate our economy, we'll have our uh, railway and maritime and air communication rehabilitated, and we hope um, a lot of investments to come to our uh, God bless country. Do you mean uh, investments from Russia or from other countries as well? Oh, of course, mainly from Russia, but we expect maybe other countries to give us investments as well. Uh, because uh, a past nation uh, is very friendly and want to be friends with everybody. We just want to live and to stand up and to voice our, our willingness to be recognized.